Hey, that meeting started today at four and we're still waiting to find out the result of that vote. But the faculty Senate chair told me earlier today there would be discussion about what's in the letter, then a vote. On April 7th, New Mexico State Athletic Director Mario Mocha signed a five year contract extension, giving him a nearly $70,000 raise. I was shocked to find out he was given that extension. Shocked. Shocked. That was reaction from attorneys representing two student athletes suing over hazing they say they endured well on the men's basketball team. The NMSU faculty Senate also reacting with the letter titled, quote, deep concern regarding the contract renewal of the NMSU athletic director and the lack of following of NMSU mission, vision and values. The letter saying the AD's renewal sends a message that faculty, staff and students are not a top priority. Attorney for Deuce Benjamin and Shako Duen Wu are grateful that the university faculty are addressing their concerns. When I read it, I it just made me feel really good to know that there's a support system here for these kids. If you support these kids, keep going, keep making statements, keep being brave. Part of the letter says if the university wanted to allow Mocha to turn the athletic department around, his contract still allowed for another year. Faculty say the renewal was not necessary. Shaq's attorney for the lawsuit agrees. It may have been a good idea to uh, tell his, his then uh, boss, Hey, let's get through this first. There's plenty of time for me to uh, extend this contract. If the NMSU Faculty Senate votes to pass that letter, it will then be sent to the interim chancellor, provost, and the Board of Regents. In the studio, Stephanie Muniz, KYT Action 7 News.